So in the woods behind me, I've hidden a few truffle scented baits. We've got a couple of bottles and a couple of squash balls with each with a couple of drops of truffles, truffle oil in them. And this time I've actually buried them 24 hours ago uh, so that they've had a chance, the scent has had a chance to sort of naturalize. And this time it means Buddy's gonna be working to a more realistic sort of scenario when he comes to actually hunt for these truffle baits. So it's sort of that next progression in terms of the advancement of this training session. So we're also out in the woods as well. We're not doing this in a simple environment like our garden or even in the park, but I think he's got what it takes. And uh, I think, fingers crossed, he's gonna do a really good job. So let's get to it. So just off to my left over here, we have the um, truffles hidden and I don't actually remember exactly where they are but I've tied a little bit of string above one of the branches that sort of overhangs the spot so I'm hoping I'll be able to just um, you know hope hopefully Buddy will be able to find them for me but if not I do have some string uh, marked out so I can actually have a go he's already sniffing the ground wanting to have a go because he knows roughly this is the area where we've done this training before um, but what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to put him on the long line just so that I have a bit of long distance control because Buddy's in the ha because he does things so quickly he can run back and forth and cover a large area and actually sometimes I think that's to his disadvantage because he's going to be going so fast he might miss the scent so by having a bit of control on the long line I can rein him in or keep him to search a certain area so we'll give this a go Buddy here I see oh you good boy okay are we ready then? Right, I've got to try and remember where the first one is. I think it's there. Okay, I see. Ready. Travel along. One down, very good boy. Oh yeah, you got the ball. Okay, get the ball for the first one. Come on, get it. Good boy. Okay, you ready? Travel off. Two out of two, two out of two, you did well. You did really well, good boy, yeah. Okay, I think there's about four more. Oh boy, give me that ball, you cheeky monkey. Okay, not sure exactly where they are, but okay, travel on.
Da. Oh, yes, good boy, Bob! Good boy! Oh, he's a good boy! He's a good boy! Yeah! Well done! Well done! Good! Good! See? Come on! Good boy! Oh, whoa! Good boy! Good! That's four, is it? Is that four? Four? I think there's one more somewhere, I'm not sure. Good boy! Good! good. Very good boy! I think there's one more. Well, that was really, really good. I think, I think there might be one more, but I'm not sure. Um, we might go find that in a second. But he's just got four out of four, absolutely smashed it. And he was already doing his uh, down indication very nicely. So uh, really happy with his progress. And um, you've done really well, boy. And you deserve the ball in your mouth. Take it. Good boy. Good boy, yes. So I think we just need to do some more sessions like this because he's clearly capable of doing it. And, um, you know, some of those, some of those scents, I actually buried a good two inches underneath the soil. And, uh, and yes, yeah, so I'm really impressed. I'd like to do it now in a few different locations um, because this woodland, this soil is not, uh, you know, ideally suited for the gourmet truffles. So we might need to do something similar in a different type of woodland, you know, more oak based, uh, more limestone chalky um, uh, soil. But really happy with this progress. And uh, yeah, if you like that video, give it a like, give it a thumbs up and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Leave a comment and I'll definitely answer you. All right, take it easy. Bye bye.